Welcome back to another Good Buddy Fly Fishing episode. I'm here on the Nanahala. It's been a great river so far. I'm kind of recording the intro after catching an absolute ton of fish. But yeah, it's uh, it's been a good day so far. I'm here with Steve on our annual Good Buddy trip with a bunch of other guys. So we're having a good time catching a bunch of fish. Yeah, just, uh, yeah, enjoy. Oh, man. Look at that. There we go. Steve's up to zero fish. I've got three. Started with a uh, Euro nymph set up, and I am terrible. I caught four fish on it, but it's my first one, so it's first fish under an indicator. But man, these are some pretty, pretty brookies. Dang. Makes me happy. Gotta love a good butt hook rainbow. All right, sorry, bro. You're good. Probably about half the fish, he comes over and swims and checks out what I'm doing. That's like crazy. Like right at my feet. But he's, I mean, you can see his fins, it's amazing. All right, so, so Steve, how many fish did you catch right here? Maybe 20. That's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. All right, let's see what happens. Most of them are in the black water. Here comes, can you stand upstream with me? You already done for the day? Yeah, I saw my limit. Nineteen of them are on a white chick area, the others on a circle. Did you see? I saw him. He was right there. I love the fact I can see these fish, man. Yeah. There, there. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I catch a lot of brookies. Okay, all right, there you go, bud. Dude, it's nice. They're nice, dude. I know they're stock. Yeah, it's hard to tell, but I don't know if that brook trout that I'm looking at is a wild one, but it's got those real those bright red fins. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Dude, these fish are amazing. I'm not gonna lie, these brook trout are so much fun. And now, he's all wrapped up. There we go. Look at that, man. Such pretty fish. Oh, my bad, bro. Oh, no. Oh. Golly. Oh jeez, they're so slimy. Who's the other net? Oh man. Jeez, man. Um, why, why 2K and a little woolly booger? Okay, okay, stop. So my GoPro just messed up and I was like trying to tell you that I just got a my first rainbow in a while. 
And then as I was trying to figure out my camera, I got hit. Dude, man, it's getting ridiculous. Okay, all right, settle, settle down. Nice. So switch to a dry dropper. Nothing on the dry, but a bunch of fish on the Y2K. I'm trying a pheasant tail as well. Golly, it's so crazy. Y2K is just hammering these DH fish. That's a little rainbow there. There we go. Oh, nope. There we go. Find your way, buddy. First fish that actually ate the pheasant tail. Crazy. So first brown trout. That's like a really good condition. I, I don't know. Sorry. There you go. Like I assume that there's wild fish in there, but that fish looks in pretty good shape. But that's the uh, North Carolina DH slam right there. So here's the rainbow. So here's the deal. Yeah, I'm going to try to go get it for you. Yeah, so Steve's been high holing us for, I don't know, an hour, two hours, catching a ton of fish. But that, that rainbow just came right after him. So I'm going to go uh, try to rescue an indicator for somebody else real fast. Still over here picking up Steve's sloppy seconds. There we go. That's why I wore my brook trout shirt. It's a big help. Ugly shirt I own. <clears throat> there we go. Finally caught one in the mouth. Jeez. I feel like a huge fly fisherman over here. Butt hooking every fish. It's like a really, really deep hole that Steve fished for like an hour. And uh, I guess it was good. It's still good. I've caught two fish so far. You're not going to believe this. But I just took the Y2K off and put on a red copper John and a Prince Nymph. Not a bad fish. Actually, after about been spoiled today, after about 30 minutes of no fish, it's kind of frustrating. You'll take what you can get. So I'm back to where we started, where Steve caught. 20 fish and they are still here gosh he's right there I see him Red copper John. So I just met a kid and his dad, uh, and he's on the national youth fly fishing team. And he said they're not allowed to use mops in competition. They said try a chartreuse uh, mop. I did, and I caught a fish. I think they're 
YouTube channel. It's called Happy On The Fly. I'll have to check that out. Um, yeah, really cool kid. Hope he uh, does well in the competition coming up. Well, looks like we're about to get some rain. But I haven't caught one in a minute. I caught this guy way, way, way downstream. Doing a mega drift. Okay. All right, this is a, an experimental fly I was trying. I've taken three casts and caught two fish. Yeah, there it is. But I put like a fluorescent green chenille off the back of a Y2K. So stupid. I know I fish these things all the time, but works on these stalkers. So, a little brookie. This fish might have the most messed up tail I've ever seen. I'm surprised he can swim. Look at that. Dude, Steve, come cast right here. There's two really nice fish right here. Dude, why? Oh, man. I got him. I got him. Oh, geez. That's the fish that I wanted right there. Oh, man. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I don't know if this is going to be. Dude. That's a great brookie right there. Rainbow. Did he break you off? Yes. And he didn't use a net when he had a fish on. Oh, my fish is still in there. Jeez, my bad. There he is. <laughs> Take off, brother. Come on. You're almost there. Hey, do you have, did you bring your net? Okay, good. So this is the hole we started in this morning. It's now four o'clock and we're still pulling an insane amount of fish out of this hole. It's crazy. There we go. Yay. Hey Steve, watch how I use my net. Watch it. See? Steve has two fish on at the same time. Did you get them? Oh. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's awesome, man. Here. Giant. I mean, giant. Okay, just be patient. No side pressure. Oh gosh, he's right under me. I'm all into the guides. Where'd he go? This might be a while. I mean, giant. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, drag. Let's go, don't let me down.
Dude, this fish is a giant. Oh, yes, that's a big brown, man. Dude. Yes. Woo. That was awesome. Yeah, that'd be great. He ate the uh, nano egg. Gosh, I wish I could... Uh, let me get him back in the water a little bit. Oh my gosh. Dude, that's that could be my the fish of the trip. That's, uh, that's fantastic. Yeah, man. Hey, yeah, it's a great fish. That is a beautiful fish. That's like I dream about catching that. Whew, man. There you go. That was a killer brown. Dude, that's awesome. Whew, I don't know if I can beat that one getting windy it's getting cold we got a cold front coming in we're gonna be fishing tomorrow on the tuck and uh, it's supposed to be 29 in the morning which is not warm uh, but yeah great great day we caught a ton of fish we all like I, mean, I don't think any of us had a bad day so uh, lots of fish I mean I would say maybe a couple hundred between the five of us so it's a good day we'll do this again tomorrow thanks for coming along subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in the next one